So, removing rear seats from the 207. Now, for the next part, we will need to disconnect these two connectors, which are for the seat belts. But in order to do that safely, we'll have to disconnect the battery. Now, to be safe, let's wait five to 10 minutes. Then we can disconnect those and then remove those nuts. Right, let's disconnect those. Quite simple. Or not. That's only to be on the very, very safe side. And uh, now we can uh, get cracking. Removing those, they are both 16 mil. Let's see where we go from there. Now, with this not removed and the bolt removed from there, it's quite easy. You just get this out of the way and now, this this section the big section you just have to wiggle it out of the way it's a bit complicated with uh, one hand so basically you'll have to lift it and then slide this bracket towards the the back of the car and then it will just slide out of that uh, that joint over there so uh, let's see how it goes Actually, you have to slide it towards the front of the car. So uh, this was here. So I lifted it and pushed it uh, towards the front of the car. Then hopefully I'll be able to do this with one hand. We'll be able to slide it out of the pin. There we go. Uh, yeah, and then just lift it and uh, remove it. And uh, that goes for the rear as well because the slider it's right there so uh, yeah those are uh, rear seats removed right you also might want to remove this which holds uh, the third seat belt because that seat belt is inside this so you can't remove it unless you undo this There we are. Yeah, I will have to tidy up uh, that mess over there. But uh, basically, there you go. Not rocket science, but uh, yeah, took me, I think, total of 20 minutes.